Yo, what's up people? It's your boy P, also known as Captain P67. We're back here today with another unique video breakdown for you. Now, if you're new to my channel and my content, I stream Last Epoch every single day. I do carry to the community every day, six to eight hours every day. I do YouTube videos every day about the game, uh, one shot in bosses, build video guides, breakdowns, tips and tricks, stuff like that. Weave as well, etc. Legendary Potential. Plus, I also cover all the uniques in the game as well. Um, and today's unique is the Cycle of Putrescence. It is a ring, a unique ivory ring. It has plus 39% necrotic resistance, which is dope off tops. It's quite a lot as well, uh, resistance. Has plus 19% ward retention. Now, again, not 19, it's 19%. So it's a fifth already, almost. It's really good. Um, it also comes with legendary potential. So if you don't know what legendary potential means, it's basically a numerical number on top of a legendary. You can get between one and four. So every unique could potentially get LP4 on there. And all that means is whatever number you have on there, that's how many additional skills you can add on top. So since we've got legendary potential one, when I read out all the stats, we can potentially add another stat on top of that. So next in the text is, your volatile zombies have a chance to resurrect equal to 100% divided by your number of zombies you have. So whatever you have, you have a chance to resurrect 100% divided by whatever number you have on top. It also has 61% increased minion spell damage. So it is very unique where it doesn't say actual damage, it says minion spell damage. So be careful what you're building into. But again, 61% is a nice buff to have on top. It has plus 20 poison damage for your minions damage over time spell so again if you're using like minion spell damage with a poison on top you can have 20 plus poison on top of that as well it also has one plus damage to overtime minion skills so obviously if you're procking into you're gonna have more damage over time to add on top of that so so far it's got a mix of like resistance but it seems like it's gone for more the offensive towards the end and then on top of all of that you have plus 31 minion fire resistance so it's more of a defensive one of the resistance part for your minions, but the rest of it obviously seems a bit uh, offensive with the volatile zombies and resurrection and stuff of that, which is going to go all in concise because obviously using volatile zombies, so you're going to explode and do fire damage. The more resistance they have, better, but then they're going to explode anyway. So you might have to proc into that too much, but to have that as a bonus is dope. And like I said, legendary potential one at least, I can add more to it as well. But yeah, folks, that is today's unique for you. So if you're running any sort of necro build and volatile zombies, give this a search out, give it a try, see what you can come up with. Obviously ward retention, resistance, as well as more damage, more resistance for your minions, and obviously the spell damage as well. Uh, links will be in the description below. So if you're going to support my Twitch channel in any way, shape, or form, you can follow the channel, you can subscribe to my channel, you can gift, it, gift to the channel or gift a sub, you can uh, tip, you can donate as well. If you're going to support my YouTube channel in any way, shape, or form, you can like the video, you can comment on the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel as well. And you can post in the comments below if you're using this ring already, if you're looking for the ring, what LP you've got, how you find the game, the builds, etc. as well. And then on a quick note, if you are a newer player per se at the game, you're super new or just even mediocre, you're more than welcome to join. I can boost your levels up and carry you through the game, help you out, help you target farm. And if you're an OG or someone who knows a lot about the game, you can always join the stream and chop it up. We can always run high corruptions and just have some fun in the game too. So it doesn't matter what kind of view you are, you're always welcome here and you can chop it up and have some fun. But again, I do love the game, I'm passionate about it, it's a phenomenal game as well. But yeah, I'm part, and part from that, that is today for you. So it doesn't matter where you are, have a good morning, have a good night, have a good evening. I will catch you in the next one. Take it easy and peace out folks.